awesome. <laughs> a little bit sweaty, of course. Uh, the show was amazing. The, the crowd um, was absolutely uh, cool. They, they killed it. And uh, yeah, it's the uh, first time since 2022. Um, we played in, in, in Belgium, um, the last time was I think in April 2022, so we didn't make it in 2023 and that's why we're really happy to be back again. Yeah, that's nice to hear. I, th I think it's uh, because we have um, all the setup done um, and do it all with the digital uh, sound, not uh, using um, normal uh, guitar boxes, cases. Uh, no, no, no. Uh, we didn't come with our own sound engineer. Um, we have a sound engineer sometimes with us, but uh, yeah, it depends if he has the time or not. <laughs> It's um, all about um, political um, topics uh, in general, but uh, we put it into a, into a bigger context in a, in a storyboard, um, I guess. So um, we had yeah, a, a story up over the last two albums, Operation Mental Castration and Imperium, um, to um, have another layer of, um, uh, um, of, of lyrical uh, themes, so um, it's art, so <laughs> um, the lyrics aren't that directly uh, like we used to uh, write them in, in, uh, yeah, on, the, on the first um, two or three albums, um, yeah, but it's cool, I like it. <laughs> Yeah, but we want to we want to uh, use music to, to bring a message for uh, the audience, for our fans. Um, like, yeah, we're really open-minded uh, persons and love everybody. So this is the message we want to um, bring out to, to the world. Um, say no to racism, homophobia, sexism, and so on. Um, and that's uh, what we like uh, to to live, uh, and hope other persons will do it too. Yeah, of course. We played many shows over the last 15 years. We founded back in 2008 when we were 15 years old. <laughs> we played many cool club shows, many cool festivals. Um, yeah, I think uh, the Summer Breeze Open Air is the festival we're um, playing <laughs> uh, yeah, for, the, for the fourth time this year. And uh, it's a festival uh, we love because it um, originates from our hometown, Abtsgmünd, where we are also from. Abtsgmünd, it's, it's in southern Germany, Baden-Württemberg. And uh, yeah, without the Summer Breeze open air, we never would made it into metal. Uh, we were like 12 and 10 years old, we first visited this festival in our hometown and then said, yeah, one time we will um, play on this festival too, stand on the stage and yeah. That's why I think it's the favorite festival of us all. <laughs> uh, actually, um, I think the Wacken Open Air is the, the festival everybody knows. Um, 2024 will be the first time we will play at Wacken Open Air. So I think this is, this is what, what every band wants to do once in a lifetime. Um, yeah, we had a really busy year, uh, 2023. We played uh, two tours, um, once in Germany, Switzerland, Czech Republic, Austria, and uh, a UK tour. The first time we went to the United Kingdom with our friends in Messiah. Um, we released uh, two singles with music videos, we released a new album, we wrote a, a whole new album and recorded it, yeah. released it and played so many festival shows. So I think 2024 will be a year that's more quiet for us as a band. Um, but uh, of course we will promote our new album and be around at many different festivals, uh, especially in the, in the summer. Um, and we are open for every um, club show. Maybe we will do some some short uh, tours. Um, let's see. <laughs> uh, no, um, nobody of us is a, is a full-time musician. All yeah, get all the bands. Yeah, uh, it's just our most favorite hobby, so to say.
I don't know. I also don't think we uh, uh, we're, we're thinking a lot about how we create our music, how we write our songs. We're just uh, yeah. Uh, Get influenced by what we like, what the music we listen to, and I think it's, it's a mashup of all together.